Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the text play editor in Filmora 13. In my opinion, I think this is a good feature because some people cannot hear the audio while editing video. So they want to edit the video like editing text. So this is possible in Filmora 13 now. All right, so you can create just an amazing video like this with the text play editor and you can also add subtitle to your video automatically. Okay, so let me show you how to do that in my computer screen. Alright, so this is my Filmora 13. By the way, I'm currently using classic layout mode. If you want to change the layout, you want to just click here. Normally, it will be the default layout. So if you want to have the same user interface like me, just select the classic layout, okay? Alright, so this is my example video and this is the intro of this video. First up, you want to use the AI text editor. You want to just right click here at the media and you want to select this one, AI text by editing. Okay, so it will open a new window. By the way, if you drag and drop it onto the timeline and you want to start the editor at just a section of your video, you can also do that. For example, I can split the video right here and split it right here. Now you want to start the text by editor. You want to right click here at the video or the timeline and you have the same option, smart edit tools and you can see like AI text by editing. Okay, so it is similar to silent detection option. All right, so let's delete this one. So first up, you want to right click here at the video in the media library and you want to select this option, AI text by editing, okay. And now you have two options. The first one is sound based editing. Okay, so this is similar to silent detection in Filmora 12. So you want to select this option, text based editing first. For the video language, you want to select the same language as you talk in your video. In this video, I talk in English, so we can select English, US. Okay, by the way, if you speak in other language, you can select it here also. Okay, and next up, you want to click OK. Now the software will transcribe your video into text and open a new text based editor for you. Okay, just wait a few minutes. Okay, so after finishing, this is a new window. It is a text based editor in Filmora 13. By the way, this is a, a window and you have the preview window here and you have the text area here. And down here, you have the timeline and you can zoom in and zoom out the timeline with your mouse also. And you can just click here to zoom in the timeline and click here to zoom out the timeline. You can just click here to view everything on the timeline. You can go one frame forward and one frame backward and play the video. Hi guys, welcome to another and stop the video. So it is the same with Filmora user interface. Okay, and down here you have a track for title or the subtitle. And this is the video track. And now if you select everything here, it will select all the text right here also. Okay, and on the right side, we have the text editor. So we can start from the beginning. For example, we can select the sil this silent here and play the video first. Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the text play editor in Filmora 13. Okay, so when you play the video, the text will also be highlighted here. And on top left of the window right here, you have the drop down menu. If you select it, you have the delete button. If you select the text here, you can just select the delete button to delete it or delete or to delete everything here. Okay, and you can also search for the text inside your video. For example, I can search for 13 and then I can just click here, 5, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so when I say 13, we find it in my video and you can select the delete button to delete the 13 in my video something like this so it will delete all the 13 and we can press ctrl z to undo the action okay so that's simple right and added to that i can just highlight this one and click here to go back to the text editor and we have the silent here so if you see here it is in green this is a silent so if we find all the silent here and we want to delete all the silent we can just select this option delete all silent clip by the way i don't want to do that because sometimes i just want to keep the silent in my video okay so that is how you can delete all the silent in your video similar to the silent detection function in filmora 13. and on the timeline if you see the title track you can also edit the text and trim the text here also it will trim the video also so now all i need to do is to find the text that i want to delete in my video and highlight right here for example i can highlight this part and delete it
All right, so finally I finished editing my text. By the way, before I export it to the timeline, don't forget to check this box to go to subtitle editor after exporting. So this will open a new subtitle editor where you can adjust the text, like the size and the style of the text also to make it more interesting. Okay, so now I'm going to export it to my timeline. Okay, so this is the subtitle editor. And now we can correct my text and also we can change the format of my text also. Hi guys, uh, let's play. Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you. Uh, here it is. In this video, I'm going to show you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the text play editor in Filmora 13. It is the text play editor in Filmora 13. Okay, by the way, we can increase the size of the text also. Uh, for example, I can select 40. And maybe I want to select another preset, yellow one. Okay, and apply to all. And let's click save to go to my Fimura timeline. Okay. And now we have a video here and a subtitle here. So we want to play it. Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the text play editor in Filmora 13. In my opinion. Okay, so at this portion, I think there's something wrong with the audio, so we can split it and we can delete it. In my opinion, I think this is a good feature because some people. Good feature, by the way. I have to correct my subtitle. This okay. Is a good feature because some people cannot hear the audio while editing video, so they want to edit the video like. Alright, so this is how to use the text by editor in Filmora 13. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.